a remaster is really more of a tech art endeavor. This was remade from the ground up. No matter what we were making, it was going to be compared not to the original, it was going to be compared to the memory of the original. It became pretty clear that this is going to require more than just like a remastering approach. We really want to recreate this for the technology as opposed to putting a machine over it. We have new tools that allow us to make better looking animation, improvements in character rigs and facial rigs. The characters were rebuilt. We didn't just take the original model of Henry and Sam. We built a new Henry and Sam. We only take what we have to. Let's do a side-by-side -side review. It would stop multiple times just to be like, oh my gosh, just look at that. Things that make like the shirts wrinkle, the muscles deform correctly, facial details add such a layer of richness and life to the character. As someone who wants to play this game again is the thing I am most excited about. The scene at the beginning of the game, that was one that terrified us to remake. When Joel cradles Sarah up to him and you see their cheeks smashed together, the tears streaming down the face, there's a physicality that we were unable to achieve the first time we made this. All the art has been rebuilt from scratch. A great example is in the Boston State House Museum. On the lower floor, there's some back rooms that in the original game were generic offices. Now there's like an art restoration station. There's busts of American colonial figures on the walls. We have a completely new AI core. Encounters will play out in a much more dynamic way. You might play it 10 different times and get 10 different results for how the combat went. All of that at the end of the day is in service of the storytelling. We want to be very faithful to the original experience, to be very true to what fans love about that game, and give them the best version of this game possible. Mm -hmm.